In the seventh question, we are given a function fx equals to 28x square plus 3 by 6, where x lies between 0 to 6. The estimated area obtained by dividing the interval into three subintervals of equal length and left end points of the subintervals for height of rectangle is. So we have to find the estimated area. So first we are given x belongs to 0 to 6. So let's divide it into three equal intervals. That means 0 to 2, then 2 to 4 and 4 to 6. Right. And we are said that the left end point of sub interval will be taken as height. So height will be taken for of 0, of 2 and of 4. And you can clearly see that this represents a quadratic equation. So the graph will, let me plot the axis, the graph will roughly look like this. Okay. And we are finding the area. So, we are finding area like this. If this is 6, this is 4, this is 2 and we are finding approximated area like this. Okay. So, let's start. So, F0 equals to 3 by 6. As you can clearly see, so the height of rectangle is going to be 3 by 6 and the length is equals to 2. Okay, 0 to 2 is 2. Then we add the area of the next part, next rectangle. So the height will be taken as f of 2, which comes out to be 28 into 4 plus 3 by 6, which on calculation gives us. 112.5 into 2 that is the length okay and now finding out the final area here 4 is going to be the height so f of uh, let's find it out at the side f of 4 equals to 28 into 16 plus 3 by 6 which comes out to be 448.5 so we add 4 Four eight point five into 2 so you can clearly see this is going to be half and this becomes 1 so our area is equals to 1 plus this 2 times becomes 2 2 5 plus 8 9 7 so our complete area comes out to be 2 2 5 plus 8 98 which comes out to be 1 1 2 3 unit square so our final answer is going to be one one two three